Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Raging Rob. Gonna be trying to do some of this here gameplay. No, gonna be doing a gameplay of this game. I have no idea what it consists of, or I don't know anything about it. But it was free. I'm pretty sure it's been out for quite a while. But um, I don't know. I don't know like anything about it. Like I haven't even like this. I've gotten to here, and I wanted to make sure all my stuff worked right first. But you know how that goes. So I had to reset everything. Anyways, we're gonna jump right into this. And I'm I may do a full playthrough on this game. I'm not sure. We'll see how how we like it. And if you guys actually feedback for once rather than just watching it like a like a mannequin, that's not a reference to the mannequin challenge because that and to me is just ridiculous. Anyways, jump right in this murder. Soul I'm Raging Rob. Who do you think I am? You know who you're talking to right now? I'm Raging Rob. New game. Let's get this going. Present day. A serial killer is terrorizing the normally sleepy this streets of Salem. This crude drawing of a bell has been left at the scene of several murders Leading over the past few weeks. police refer to the weeks. murderer as the Bell Killer. We spoke with the public relations officer. Authorities are asking anyone with any leads to contact this the SPD's anonymous tip line. This picture of a bell, the calling part, line. the police have yet to Leading attach any meaning or significance to, has become synonymous with no the hysteria surrounding his murders. You're saying there are no leads? No leads at all? What the hell? Somebody told me this is a horror game. Grow up on the streets. You start thinking you're invincible. Nothing can touch you. You never really lose. Go to arrest some freak. Find out you aren't as invincible as you thought. What kind of name is Ronan? That kid stole my wallet! Time to make it official. Dad, it hurts! You steal my car, you pay the price! Ah! Under arrest for the assault and battery, Vincent Coulter. Guilty on two counts of grand theft auto. <laughs> on the indictment of burglary. Grand larceny and assault with a deadly weapon. <laughs> Let me take it. <laughs> I can't have my sister marrying some bum, right? They do. Oh, yeah, I do. No. No, Julian. Stay with me, you hear me? Julia. No, stay with me! Stay with me! Your family wore felonies like badges of honor. Now you think this new badge covers all that up? You're a fucking criminal. You need to slow down, man. Right? This is crazy. I didn't know better. So you actually want to die. Turn around. You're under arrest. <gasps> I have to interrupt that. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Um, the process you saw with the tattoos there is a reference. I mean, it's a possibility either somebody just did some research, which honestly in games is a very important thing. Um, it's also possible that one of the creators of this game may have been a convict in the past based on its design because 
prisoners, um, get their tattoos mostly once they're inside when they give themselves their own tattoos, which is illegal, technically, against the rules, such and such. Anyway, um, their tattoos all have a story behind them. They each represent something, um, as you saw there, cheated death, uh, assault, uh, assault and battery, and then the attempted murder, and all that stuff, and you saw the gun, and you saw the sands of time, um, where you, where you said you wanted to die. So that's actually a really, really, really respectful detail, I guess I could say. It's, um, I, it's, it's a very, it's... He paid close attention to detail is the way what I'm trying to say here, and I I really really like that because any person in my opinion who gets a tattoo just to get a tattoo and it doesn't have any reasoning, it it's just it's idiocy, it's it's um it's not the way it should be, uh, in my opinion of course. Like if I was to get a tattoo, uh, mine would definitely have to have meaning behind it, something in resorts to ancestry. Anyway, I'm gonna shut up. Let's go. Being silent. Any cop you throw out of a window, will hunt you down and kick your ass. Can you move any faster? Uh, I, mean, I know you sell like two stories, but you got up pretty fast. Uh, uh, Again, looks really good. Should I knock? How do I know? Knob ain't even moving, it's stuck. Oh. Watch it, oh lady. It's got knocked out. No. No. No, no, no. the hell? Let me reach for my face. Touch. I'm still alive. I can fix it. I just get back in my body and then maybe I'll, I'll, I'll wake up. Interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> Come on, someone had to hear that glass shatter. Now somebody would have heard those gunshots. What do you do? Seven, eight, more or less? Somebody would have heard that. Gorgeous. No, you're not supposed to go toward the light. I refuse. Ronan? You're not supposed to go toward the light. Okay, I can run. Can I sprint? Jog, which nice sprint. 
You're not supposed to go toward the light. It's a freak dude. It said go toward the light, but you're not supposed to. Family. I don't guess I have a choice. Oh, it's so bright. Ronan? I can't believe it. I can't believe I found you. Oh my god. Julia. I thought I'd never see you again. You look good. <laughs> I look better. God, I've missed you. You can't touch me. I would give anything to be there with you. For us to be together again. But But what? You can't touch me. No. Oh no, no, not again. Not you. If you're not here, where are you? It's the other side of the bridge. Bridge? What what bridge? Where you are is a prison, or a bridge. It all depends on how you see it. Either way, where you are isn't safe. Do you hear me? We need to get you across the bridge. You need to move on. Move on? Is that where you are? Don't worry about me. Something about your life isn't finished yet. We don't have much time. Think. What about your life feels unresolved? I don't know. To figure that out. Now go. No. Julia, you left me once and it destroyed me. Please, please don't leave me again. We'll see each other again, love. Just save yourself. No, no, no Julia! Don't leave me, Julia! Damn it! Hello? There's a man in the street outside the Regal Apartments bleeding. He's been shot. Send an ambulance. He's not breathing. My friend says he's not breathing. I can't feel a pulse. There's broken glass everywhere and, and a lot of oh, blood. Man. This is bad. Yeah, I'll stay on the line until help arrives. Personally, I don't know a lot of people would be that calm about it. Hey, man. Can you hear me? Lady, please. Damn it. Hey, you. No. Hey, can you hear me? Hell no. You don't ever follow. No. You don't ever follow the little girl. You. Oh my. No. Oh god. Just no. No, 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 this is gonna turn bad. It's gonna turn very bad. Come on, your ass. I got you. Bring your ass here. You can't run fast in this? Hey, why did you run? It gets old, giving counsel to the new ones. Don't take it personal. Running through walls, making things appear, you you look like you've been here a while. You must know how this place works, then. <laughs> works? This place isn't hard to understand. Figure out your gifts, and maybe you won't get trapped here. Shut up, phone. What do you mean, gifts? Your strengths in life are stronger in death. They become powers here. Some power is unique, some common. Possession, influencing people, manipulating the more fragile of ghostly objects to appear or disappear. Strengths become abilities. Huh. The door just hit me, but I'm passing through other stuff. What is it with this place? I thought I'd be able to walk through everything. We can't enter the buildings the people of Salem have consecrated. Save through an opening. An open drawer, or a window. But once inside, walls and doors hold no power over us. You'll know the ghostly objects we can't pass through by their blue glow. It will all seem logical in due time. I don't believe it will. Who are you? 
Looks like you've been here a while. Me? I'm just someone like you. But hear me when I say this is no playground. You can rob yourself of your future, or others can do it for you. What do you mean, others can steal my future? Demons. They were once like us, but lost themselves. They can never move on now, and exist only to consume those lingering here. Those like us. I getcha. No, I, I, I'm sorry, I, I don't understand what you're talking about. How could I rob my own future? You're here to resolve something. You don't resolve it, you don't leave. Don't worry, that's pretty common. Common? That's crazy. So, I need to figure out who killed me and stop him. That's the way I can get out of here. Well, best of luck to you. Wait, 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 wait. there's more I need to know. You don't follow the little girl, dude. I'd be a demon. Great. Be careful out there. You never know what's waiting around the corner. Weird. Alrighty then. I'm going to attempt to get back to my body. This is the way I went to this. Yep, 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 yep. Wonk. Oh. Seeing your own body lying on the street. It's like looking in a mirror you don't want to see but can't turn away from. And that's when you realize you no longer know which one's real. And which is the reflection? <laughs> yeah, great idea, Baxter. Tamper with the evidence. Backup. Who needs backup? <laughs> you shouldn't have tried to be one of us. <laughs> Man, you were one dumb son of a bitch. <clears throat> Sir? <clears throat> oh! Hey, 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 Baxter, hey! Hey, just get back to taking them statements. Yeah, I'm the stupid one. Look, this is not your scene, Lieutenant. Just pay your specs and move on, please. Yeah, maybe it's not my scene, but it is my case. Tomorrow it'll be my case, and the next day, until we catch him. You do well to remember that, Sergeant. Look, I'm just following Captain's orders here. You know the procedure when a family member is given. Yeah, well. Take all the time you need, LT. I lost count of the times I wished you were dead. Do me a favor, con man. Tell Julie I miss her. She knows, Rex. She knows. I need to find my killer's trail before it goes cold. Okay. I need to get my eyes on Stuart's notepad. See what they've learned. Did you, did you see the man in the woods? Yes. I saw him. 
He killed that man in the street. I see. Look at all these people. It'd be nice to know what they're talking about. I gotta see if they found any leads that I don't already know about. Clues here have gotta tell me something. Well, I was here when it happened. You don't need to know much else, do you? Interesting. I can possess people? Are you kidding me right now? Possess. Then it's missing. Wrong to rolling. Can't do it again. Probably should have like a different one there. This why does this always happen to me? All I want Okay. Be patient with her. She's upset. She's not used to dealing with scenes like this. Lady, you still with us? You you just stop talking. I oh and is that blood? I can't even imagine. How about this? What about his family? I knew it. I should have chosen a different one. Hello? Can't even believe I'm dealing with Okay, 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 okay. Hang on. Oh, he really, really wanted to kill the hat out of you. He shot you a lot of times. Back up. Okay, so what do you do if he, that's your backup with your original? I don't think they know anything. This whole thing is just weird. All of us cops just getting nowhere. Looks like the boys are doing everything we can do. I don't know, Jack. to the chest, you really point have, blank. You really have no idea when to quit, do you, Baxter? <laughs> Ever take a look at those tattoos of his? All that gangland prison crap? He was more criminal than cop. Yeah, he lived like a thief, he would die like a thief. He was still a badge, dickhead. Oh, all right. Well, that guy doesn't like me, so I'm gonna get out of here. Influence. The ability to correctly influence a person is dependent on the clues you find in the investigation. So can I go back over here to this guy? I can. I can't do anything with him. I picked the wrong clue. Just stay calm. People need the cops to be calm now. They do. Why are cops so tight-lipped? Don't they know publicity will help them? I don't think they would. Amazing. It's like she hits a switch and she's on. I could never do what she does. Hard to believe that's a dead body right there. Glad I'm not a cop. This is all just so out of control. These people don't know anything. He's the one that I needed to look, and I, I didn't. I screwed it up. Cause I suck. 
four of eight clues found. Oh, I didn't even think. I probably should go up top where he pushed me out the window, which was through this door. That's window. I need to find the window. Alright, she's the one. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I saw it. That man in the hood. Outside. Uh, looking up at, at the top apartment on the fourth floor, I think. Okay, we got something. We got something. So they haven't okay hang on used to dealing with scenes like this can I possess the sergeant again and nope not him. include investigation a uh, five of eight I don't know what else I can do killer came here for a reason but what was it the apartment up there must have some clues I spent 20 minutes trying to get up there so that's my way in and it's closed fantastic well, here's my chance I just need to follow Stuart into the building get in there Okay. Hmm. Hey, Sarge. 1019. Please return to the scene. Stand for. What the fuck? What is that? Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh no. It's just you. I knew I heard something. I shouldn't follow you. Hey, uh, shit. Are you trying to give me another heart attack? No, I, I just. It was rhetorical, for God's sake. Come on, don't look so lost. Take a look around or something. You know, spy a little. 
It's not like anyone's gonna stop you. Come back. Did I do that? Hey, hey, come back. Hey, hey. Those notes aren't for you. Great. Looks like some sort of code or something. Ah, well, I made it up to the fourth floor before the police cart away the evidence. Shit, Valdis is gonna get me killed. Mommy, mommy! Hey, you enjoy scaring kids? This little girl cost me everything. It was supposed to be a simple job, easy money. What do you mean? She's just a kid. It don't matter what she is. Her daddy owed too much to the wrong people. She was just an insurance policy. Is that where you come in? A simple snatch and grab. After everything was settled up, uh, I'd let her go. I'm guessing it wasn't so simple. That may be. But she owes me now. And I ain't leaving until her debt is paid. Cut your losses. It may be a while. Don't worry. I can wait. That's messed up, man. right I see that what is that that may be for me I may be retarded do not like that I'm in this music All right, stairs, 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 stairs. North stairwell, this way. Okay, that's the thing. <sighs> Phone is vibrating, scared to shit him. Get out of here, go away. I gotta run. If demons find you, they will hunt you down and suck your soul. Aww. Now what do I do? Escape from demons. The residue of ghost souls hide your presence from demons. The residue of ghost souls. Oh, that's sick. Come on! <gasps> if the demons can't find you for a while, they will stop checking in. So I need to wait. Hold R to see demons through walls. Remember to always approach demons carefully. Oh, hell no! Uh-uh. 
I like have to get around him. It's looking that way, but can I it's like straight up? Not gonna turn out well. Let's get the demon. Okay, cool. This makes things a lot easier. Oh, that was awesome! Hell yeah! Dude, that was sick. All right, I'm gonna get to the fourth floor, and I'm gonna stop it. Th Terrifying. This makes things so much more difficult. Okay, he turned around. I mean, he turned around. Oh, because his home cut is there. Of course, you're gonna come this way. I mean, I'll beat your ass. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Get out of here! Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. This is terrifying. Get the juice, boy. Get the juice. Really, how you do? You just teleport back. Come here. Okay. Jesus. I didn't think they had any relevance. Let's go. All right, stairwell. Okay, folks, I need you to keep your distance from the scene here. What happened up here? I'm afraid that's still under investigation. See another one. Hey, Broyles, you seen that little girl that lives here? She turns up. You come find me. Got it? Baxter looking for the girl. Okay, that's not the, that's not the backup. That's my original. Damn it! My mom gave me that gun. <laughs> what? Get out of here. What was the killer doing here in the first place? Alright, on to our second scene. That is all I'm going to do for this episode. Appreciate you guys stopping by. I'm uh, I'm enjoying it. Um, it scared the hell out of me a couple times, and it's like really got a creepy vibe to it, but I'm really enjoying it, and I hope you guys are too. If you're not, just let me know in the comments if you guys decide to leave a comment, because nobody ever leaves comments. So, 
anyway, I'm all done here for the day. Thank you for stopping by. Leave all feedback in the comments. Leave a like, please. It helps so much, and I'm so thankful for it. Um, leave a like. I'm out of here. My name is Adrian Rob. Deuces.